Bebe, watch out, watch out. Eugene Bozzi grabbed his trash can when he was told a gator was lying just outside his neighbor's front door. Somebody let me know the hand. Yeah. Hey, baby, did it, did it. The hand, baby, has it. Come on, come on, come on. Somebody got to step up and do something. We all got to look out for each other, right? Bozzi's a military veteran and a father. Only in Florida a year, the native of Philadelphia felt an alligator's power up close. I was frightened when I had it in it because it was, it was so powerful. And I expect that, and it was pushing itself out, or whipping its tail around. Now I can't say with any certainty that this is the same alligator, but it is the pond where that alligator was released by the neighbor, and the alligator right here appears to be doing well. I, I would have been gator food. I said this. I would have fainted. The six-footer was in front of her home, and she had no idea until she heard the commotion. Came outside, I was like, what in the world is going on? Because I, I heard a lot of boom, 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 boom. Once the gator was in the trash can, Bozzi quickly maneuvered it down the embankment toward the retention pond pushing it over and hightailing it up the hill. Army training kicked in, is get it done, and drop him in and keep it moving. He needed a quick return and a snatch of the trash can to complete the mission. I don't know the procedure, so I did my own way. Orange County tweeted out that people should call the state's nuisance line for alligators so a licensed trapper can take over. Bozzi is stunned by all the attention. I got so many inboxes and DMs and women saying things, men saying things, people that I do know, friends. And he can always say he went viral.